Hello everyone. Today's let's practice video, I'm going to discuss another organic conversion. Write down the steps to convert propene to 2 keto propanol. Now this is propene prop 1 in and this compound is 2 keto propanol. This is CHO group. This one is C double bond O group. So now here you can see in this conversion, this propene group convert to 2 keto propanol. That means this carbon, this CHO convert to CO and this CH2, CH2 converts to CHO. Now let's explore how we can convert propene to 2 keto propanol. First propene reacts with bromine in presence of carbon tetrachloride. It's an electrophilic addition reaction and two bromine attached with the carbon across the double bond. It is called vicinal dibromide. Now we have to treat vicinal dibromide with alcoholic KOH. Elimination reaction takes place. So in the first step, bromine from this carbon and hydrogen from this carbon will be leaving as a HBr and double bond will form. Still one more bromine is present. So that's why one more step will happen where this bromine and this hydrogen will leave as a HBr and finally we will be getting a alkyne compound. It's a propyne compound we are getting here. When propyne reacts with mercuric acetate followed by sodium borohydride reduction, we get this compound. This reaction is called oxymercuration demercuration reaction. In this reaction, we can introduce OH group across the double bond or triple bond and OH group attached with the carbon which is more substituted. In case of alkyne, first OH group attached with this carbon which is more substituted but this is not the final product. This compound looks like an enol form so ketoenol tautomerism takes place and we get this product acetone. So this is the final product for oxymercuration and demercuration reaction. Now here you can see already we have introduced the C double bond O group in this carbon. Next we have to introduce CHO group either of this carbon. So there is one reagent which is called selenium dioxide which can oxidize the methyl group which is adjacent to carbonyl group. So this CH2 will be converted to CHO. Now we have the desired product 2 keto propanol. I hope this video is helpful for your study and for your exam preparation. If you like this video, share it with your friends and subscribe my channel Chemistry Affinity to update with various chemistry related videos. Thank you for watching it.